My name is Anita Gashuma. My mentor is Judy Kaberia. The mentorship program, I joined it in, January, in February 6th of 2020. It has been a marvelous journey. The mentors have worked with us mentees. We have sharpened our skills in various things like journalism, writing blogs, uh, broadcast. Personally, the mentorship program has helped me know my place in the workplace. I recently just joined an internship uh, at the National Transport and Safety Authority and a specific webinar by Monica Ndongo from NTV made me understand more my place in the workplace, being a woman, transforming myself into the woman I want to be in a few years. And I cannot thank IWAT enough for this program, for this platform to enable myself to become a better person. Thank you, thank you very much. My name is Ruga Ival, a student from Masai Mara University. I joined this IWAT mentorship program last year in the month of February. I would say it's a golden opportunity. My best webinar program was um, from Monica Ndongo. She was mentoring up. She was mentoring us about getting a seat at the table. As a woman, I've learned a lot to be courageous and to take risk. I'm Lilian Dong from Asimara University. My mentor is Mrs. Masin Joroge. Okay, um, I joined the mentorship on in February 2020. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay, I'm Lilian Dong from Asimara University. Joined the mentorship in February 2020. My mentorship is Mrs. Masin Joroge. Okay, uh, joining the program has actually helped me um, increase Okay. From my mentor. Okay. My mentor is Mrs. Masin Joroge. Okay, joining the program has enabled me to develop my interaction skills. And then I've also get to know how digital communication operates and I'm very grateful. Yes, and I'd like the IWAT program to continue helping others so that they may impact positive effects to the society. Hi, my name is Pendo Abulitsa from Asaimara University. Uh, I do communication and journalism. Uh, my mentor is Lucy Kilalo, and I'm very grateful for the program. So thank you, IWAT. We've acquired a lot of skills. Uh, thank you very much, and I'm grateful. Yeah. Oh, Nisa Metena. Yeah. Okay. Nianzel, uh, we've acquired writing skills and more confidence and how to speak eloquently also, so thank you. My name is Caroline Konya, I joined the mentorship program in February 20, 2020, 2020, yes. oh my god, sorry, 2020. My name is Caroline Konya. I joined the mentorship program in February 2020 and the past one year has been a journey for me. I have improved. I was a mentee to Madam Brenda Zeda. The journey with her has been amazing. It has been dynamic. We have fought, we have learned, we have laughed. But at the end of the day, the relationship has still remained tight and I thank God for her because she has taught us what it means to be a female journalist in a male-dominated field and career. I want to thank God for IWAT and the opportunity that they have given us and it is my prayer that God is going to continue blessing them so that this gift is going to be given even to many more female journalist students who aspire to be where the mentors are. My name is Priska and Jerry Gekonyo. I'm a current second year student pursuing journalism and communication in Masai Mara University. I joined the IWAT mentorship program in February 2020. Yes, and um, uh, my mentor was Josephine Awareta. And uh, I have learned a lot from the program. I think more than anything, I keep on insisting that the program has been a holistic mentorship program. It has taught us not just journalistic skills, but people skills and has helped us to grow as people individually. You know that some of us are more courageous than we were in the beginning. And I think for me that 
is the most important thing and the context that it has established for me. I know that even as the program ends, I know I have sisters and mothers who I can reach out to who will help me in any situation. And if I need something to be clarified, I know I have contacts who will help me. So thank you so much to IWAD. Thank you for Hilda for thinking up of this program and to Madam Rachel and Josephine for encouraging us all the time. Yeah. Um, uh, when Hilda started this program, she said that one of the reasons was because there are no enough female gen journalists when it comes to the managerial positions. And I think that such a program as this will enable more female journalists to be there at the table where decisions are being made when, uh, so that we can even change the policies within the, the working force. We can make the working force more adjustable to women. We can make women be part of the decision makers. My name is Elizabeth Ayuma. I'm a second year student at Masemara University pursuing journalism. Uh, I joined the mentorship program last year, February. Uh, my mentor is Florence Gishoya and I think I can say that there's a big difference between me before the program and me af after the program. This is because I've gained a lot of skills, for example, writing. Uh, through the guidance of my mentor, I've been able to write several stories on my blog and a Wattpad story, and also my article was published in the Daily Nation newspaper. And what I can say about the mentorship program, it has really helped me a lot, and mostly about the webinary meetings. They are really nice. We've learned a lot. Listening to the people who have gone through the journey that we are in was really nice. Thanks to Iwat and may God bless.